Good evening, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Respected uh, eminent experts and personalities in the stage. Respected uh, naturopathy experts from all over the country who have assembled here to be a part of this brilliant naturopathy day celebration, the National Naturopathy Day Celebrations, which is also supported by the Ministry of Health and the G20 health delegations. So it's a, it's a great pleasure for me to be a part of this wonderful event, to be a chief guest for this wonderful, brilliant event, because I strongly believe naturopathy, backed by lifestyle medicine, which includes right eating, regular exercises, regular vitamins and mineral intake, sleep and stress management, yoga, meditation, avoiding any kind of addictions that includes alcohol or smoking. This all are going to play a key role in the future. And that's why naturopathy is going to be the future medicine. Well, I stop here for a while. I want to correct myself. Naturopathy is not only the future medicine. It was the medicine in the past. It is the medicine for the current. And it's going to be the medicine for the future and forever. Well, well, I have, a, I have a, a beautiful example for that. Now, the first important example is the current disease status of India. Let's start with obesity. Obesity is going massive in India. And as per the WHO status, it's clearly indicated obesity is an epidemic. Obesity is the mother of diseases. Obesity is the mother of inflammation. Obesity is the mother of mortality rates. Yes, the death rate. And that's why it's, it requires a, a strong strategy to counter obesity. And the only way to permanently correct obesity as a disease is through naturopathy backed by lifestyle medicine. So that clearly indicates the importance of naturopathy as a current medicine and a future medicine. Now, the second important example I would love, love to give on uh, diabetes. Yes, my dear friends, India stands number two in diabetes in worldwide scenario. And WHO clearly estimates if we don't work on it right now, if we don't bring in the right strategies, very soon India will become the diabetic nation. India will become the number one nation in diabetes. And that's going to make us end us in a catastrophe. That's unbelievably catastrophic because that will lead to a lot many other complications, my dear friends. Again, in this scenario also, naturopathy backed by lifestyle medicine will be the key to fight diabetes effectively and to make this problem reverse and to manage naturopathy backed by lifestyle medicine is going to be the key. Now, the third important example is the cancer scenario, my dear friends. In 1980s and 90s, we would be, like if you talk about cancer, we might be seeing in the movies only, really, right? The hero and heroines used to have cancer. We never knew that my dad had cancer, my uncle has a cancer. It was never like that. But now, there is a cancer patient in every street of India. And if you don't address it right now, every house of India will be having a cancer patient in the coming years. And before that, we have to stop it. And the principal reason of cancer is no more tobacco consumption. The principal reason of cancer is wrong lifestyle. And if you want to prevent it, if you want to correct it, if you want a cancer-free nation, the key is going to be your lifestyle. And that's what the core of naturopathy is all about. So again, from this scenario also, naturopathy is going to be the future medicine. Now, let's go to the next important scenario. That is, as per the population status of India, today, India is the number one populated nation. We are, we are beaten China just three months before. We are number one populated nation. Let's imagine we have 50% of citizens diseased, either diabetes, or hypertension, or heart disease, or cancer, or arthritis, or PCOD, or depression. Let's assume 50% of the population is 
diseased. Well, that's going to make this nation not only the number one populated nation, it will become the number one diseased nation also. Even to prevent that also, naturopathy is going to play a brilliant role. I vouch for it here. And also, imagine we have a nation filled with healthy citizens. Well, the superpower in the future is going to be the nation which has highest human resources. So, if you have a nation with highest human resources who are disease free, who are healthy, nobody can stop India becoming a superpower. That's again a possibility only through naturopathy backed by the right lifestyle science. So, the next important example would be based on the COVID scenario, my dear friends. Yes, even during the COVID pandemic, if you, if you look into it very closely, who survived COVID? If you see the death rate, 96% of death which happened during COVID was because of COVID comorbidities. People who had high cholesterol, high blood pressure, high sugar levels, diabetes, or obesity. They are the people, 97 people who die, person people who die in COVID wave, the COVID pandemic wave, is people who had comorbidities. Let's imagine they all had a healthy lifestyle. They all were not having diabetes. They were not having hypertension. They were not having obesity. How many lives you would have saved? We would have prevented n number of deaths, which is unbelievable. Again, now this pandemic is just a lesson we have to learn why we have to embrace naturopathy and a proper lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Because if we have a no comorbidity life, automatically you are well prepared for any future pandemics or any future medical emergencies. You are well prepared. So that's again clearly indicates naturopathy backed by lifestyle medicine is the future. Naturopathy is the future medicine. Now, this is the scenarios. Now, let's talk about some of the leaders, the eminent personalities who are staunch followers of naturopathy. Well, we can start from our father of nation, Mahatma Gandhi. He was a staunch follower of naturopathy. And no addiction life, no alcohol, no smoking. Yoga, meditation, regular exercises, and proper follower of discipline. Next example, Rabindranath Taguji, the greatest poet India has ever created. He was also a staunch follower of naturopathy. Then comes the man of the moment, the Honorable Prime Minister of our nation, Narendra Modi ji. He is a staunch follower of lifestyle medicine and naturopathy. And finally, Virat Kohli who hit the 50th century just three days before. He had a chronic spinal injury just 18 months before. And if you see, in that phase, in that two, three years, his sporting capabilities were very less. He was unable to score runs. But he overcame it through naturopathy, through regular exercises, right diet, right eating pattern, rehabilitations. He did it. And see, you can see the result. So, they are all the glaring example why naturopathy is the future medicine? Why everybody should embrace naturopathy and lifestyle medicine? Now, let's go to some of the examples in my own practice. I'm the personal consultant to some of the big names of India, which includes the big names in bureaucracy, the political leaders, people from big business houses, and also some of the patients internationally who work with me from UK, US, Switzerland, France, Germany, uh, Dubai, Singapore, they all, now listen to me very carefully, they all demand, they all expect natural remedy for their problems. There can be high blood pressure, there can be cholesterol, there can be PCOD, there can be depression, there can be obesity, there can be arthritis, there can be management of autoimmune disorder, can be anything. They all want a natural cure, a natural remedy for the problem. They all want to live a medicine-free life. They all want to live a disease-free life. They all want to lead a stress-free life. Now, my dear friends, there comes the need for a naturopathy health revolution. Yes, because naturopathy can lead to a disease-free life. A medicine free life, a stress free life. Well, now I all, I really want to request you all, it's time 
to create a natural party health revolution. Are you ready? Yes. yes. I can't hear you. Yes. That's attitude. That's attitude. A natural party health revolution will change this country's complete name. This country will become one of the superpowers when it comes for human resources. And that can only happen through natural body backed by a brilliant lifestyle medicine. Now, it was wonderful to interact with you all. It, it, was, a, it was a great opportunity uh, to be a part uh, in this lovely event as chief guest. So before I conclude, uh, I would like to uh, extend my uh, sincere thanks to uh, Dr. Nikki Davas for uh, uh, calling me here. Not only for calling me here as chief guest today, uh, but also uh, uh, for the incredible work she's doing uh, to promote nutrition. You can give a bigger round of applause to her also. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, for the incredible work she's doing uh, to promote the science of nutrition and the science of food is the medicine to the nook and corner of the country. For that reason, I express my sincere thanks to her and I, I uh, support you unconditionally. We'll be there for you for all your endeavors. And then, I, I let me use this uh, stage. Let me uh, use this stage to thank. Uh, it's an opportunity to thank uh, our honourable Prime Minister, the man of the moment, uh, Sri Narendra Modi ji, also for taking naturopathy to the nook and corner of the world, for creating a special ministry in the name of Irish, and then for taking Fit India movement to every youth of this nation and finally for always promoting yoga and taking it to the pinnacle. So again, thank you dear Prime Minister and we can give a big round of applause to our Prime Minister. <laughs> so for that reason, we all should be always indebted to him for his push because when a leader pushes for something, the citizens will take it very nicely. And the international community will always look forward to embrace that. So that way, we should be always proud of him for this endeavor. We always put naturopathy, lifestyle medicine, yoga at the highest level. And uh, before I conclude my uh, speech, I would uh, reiterate and I want to repeat one more time. Naturopathy is the need of the heart. Right lifestyle backed by right eating and regular exercises are going to be the biggest source of preventive medicine which will help fight any medical, physical or psychological disorder. And that's the only way to prevent or reverse any disease at a permanent level. There is no other magic medicine. It is the naturopathy which is the magic medicine. Now, in the coming years, you are all the comrades. You are all the leaders. If you are going to take it forward properly, the whole world will be following you all. The whole world will look forward for the naturopathy medicine because everyone, I'm talking about my own patients in, in the international community, all big names, they all are waiting for this thing only. They want a natural remedy. So that way, this is going to be the next big thing. And before I conclude, let's make India, the health capital of the world, like our Prime Minister says, Vishwaguru. Let's make India the health capital of this world. A disease-free India is an omnipotent India in Kalab Zindabad. Jai Hind! Thank you, sir, for your wonderful words. I think we are on the right 